office is wherever I am. I like to carry it on my back on my motorcycle. I'm hired to do whatever it takes to enable developers to build the next great app on Windows Phone, on Windows 8. If it means traveling somewhere to stand on stage and give a presentation to teach them how to get started building their apps, then I'll do that. If it means going out to local user groups where developers meet, I'll also do that. You know, I have no typical day. I'll just wake up. If I don't have a presentation to give, I'll be working from home. I'll bring my computer to a coffee shop and I'll work on code samples there. If I'm traveling, I'll go to schools and give presentations. I'll travel to large events where I've been invited to be a keynote speaker. I realized I didn't want to just stay in an office on a computer in a room and just write code. I actually wanted to go out there and tell people about it. Microsoft had contacted me because I, I interned with them. They were like, hey, did you know that you know you can write code and you can go out and do everything you pretty much want to do? And I was actually just like, man, this is so great because I didn't realize that pretty much everything I wanted to do, I could actually do it in one role. I grew up doing ballet my entire life because I love being on stage and I love performing. So I kind of do that because I get to stand on stage I wanted to be a teacher because I love staying after school and tutoring my fellow students or younger students. I love to travel because I love learning about new cultures. I wanted to be a reporter because I love finding out about the latest and greatest news and I get to find out about the latest and greatest technology and share it with the world. As a woman, I feel like I'm definitely more focused on you know, how the developers feel about their apps. I definitely focus more on what I can do for them to provide them with all the resources that they need. I would say that women play a crucial role in technology because they provide skills that uh, you necessarily won't get from men. Whenever I speak to a lot of high school girls about pursuing careers in science, math, and technology, a lot of them are under the impression that you have to sit in an office and be the best at writing the code. But the thing is, I wasn't the best in computer science. You don't have to be the best, uh, and you should always keep doing what you love, because in technology, you can definitely find that role that you love doing without compromising anything.